So for the first week activity, we've selected a very short uh, reading that was something that inspired all of us. There was a forward to Seymour Papert's book, Mindstorms, where he talks about a childhood object, gears, that really influenced his thinking. Uh, and we'd like to ask people within learning creative learning to read that and then think about their own childhood objects. What objects in their childhood really influenced the way they think about themselves, the way they think about the world, and then to share that online. It'd be great if they could have a, a photo or a graphic to bring to life what the object was, and then a short description, you know, a couple of paragraphs about why this object was important to them, how it influenced them, how it inspired them. Uh, in the discussion forums, we have some links to some previous uh, childhood object descriptions from some past years and from a, from some books that Cherry Turkle had written where she uh, shared some of people's childhood object memories. So you might, people could look at those to get some ideas of how to approach it. Uh, but as I've always really enjoyed this was we just get to see the range of different ways that people engage with the world as they're growing up and how it influences them. And it doesn't have to be very long, right? It could be just a couple of paragraphs. I, I, prefer, I think it's better a couple of paragraphs because it's great to be able to read other people's reflections. So just keep it to a couple of paragraphs to me. Seems yeah, and fun. if people want to write something longer, some people have been linking to their blogs where yeah. they say more. So if they go, if people go to the discussion forums, there's a section called Activity of the Week. And if you go there for week one, it'll have a link to the Papert article about the gears of his childhood. And then people there can also share. Yep their reflections of their childhood objects. They can read others and they can reply and comment. And, yeah. um, Good. Well, we look forward to, to seeing what people write about their 